and I'm making this video to put on record here regarding a matter I have uh, pending with the Internal Revenue Service, the United States government. About in 1995-96, I did not file tax returns as I had no taxable income and no obligation to file these tax returns. The government had a different position and they they thought that I had taxable income, but we both agreed that I did not file tax returns. So uh, back and forth, government correspondence, uh, not answering my questions, not uh, actually not being responsive, just coming at me saying you owe money. They tried to hit my bank accounts. They tried to hit uh, my employer and such to get money. They never collected any money on this, but in 2008, they filed a lawsuit trying to get a judgment for $144,000 and to foreclose on my family home. Through the process, there's something called discovery, and part of the discovery is seeking answers to interrogatories. So I posed some in interrogatories, and among them I asked for copies of assessments, and, and they were never produced, and of course the government didn't have to produce them, they used some other form. Uh, to say that, yeah, they were done, but in fact don't actually produce the assessments. I also asked them to give me the code section, to provide the code section, then impose the liability on me in the first place. The government answered that the Internal Revenue Code was public record, and therefore I could go find it myself. The judge was not satisfied with that answer, so uh, he ordered the government to answer the question further. Well, then the government came back and said, here are the code sections that relate to this matter. My original question was, which section of the Internal Revenue Code imposed the tax on me? Not, here are the code sections that relate to this matter. Anyway, through a process of summary judgment, and summary judgment is supposed to be used in legal proceedings when both sides agree on the facts. There are no material issues in dispute. And you know, it's kind of like if you got in a car accident and you said, yeah, I hit the guy from behind, and the other guy says, yeah, he hit me from behind. Those are agreed upon facts, and then the law is applied, and, you know, no, no trial is needed. Well, in my case, I certainly did not agree on the facts. That, that the judge does is he rules.